some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we find ourselves in the land down under with Alex from Collaborative Audits. Now, if you've not seen this frauditor before, he is an Australian frauditor who likes to use the American script, but unfortunately, he is not in America where the laws are different than that of Australia. So therefore, he gets arrested quite frequently. Okay, now that you know what you're in for, let's watch him try and fail to audit this library. So, let's sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. Watching us. Just need to let you know that if you want to take some photos of um, signs, that's absolutely fine. Yep. But we do have a policy that you can't capture any people on the video oh. um, in the library. So can't capture people. You can't um, be filming people in the library without oh. permission. So it's a public building, government building. Yeah, we're a council oh. building. So they're in public. There's no expectation of privacy. No, there there is, and that's a council policy to respect people's privacy and as um, a child safe policy you cannot be filming in the library um, where there are people oh, yeah. so you're welcome to grab some images of our signage or i mean i might get some people like well I'm what i'm letting right you know now. is that it's against policy for you to okay. capture any people cool. on video okay. without their permission cool okay yeah. so can i just get you to um turn that off while it's <laughs> Um, I mean, it's Victorian state law. Your policy doesn't really trump the state law. I can film in public. This is a public building. I pay for it. We'll get to the uh, issues about the law in a moment, but good grief, man. Fix your damn camera. It looks like you've got a bad Dutch angle going on here, and the subject of the video is not entirely in the shot. Since you're in a library, anyway, I would suggest that you put down the camera and go find a book on how to be a proper photographer. But I'm not so sure about your reading comprehension skills, so that might be a useless endeavor. Uh, so, it's not that straightforward. So. It, it is that straightforward. Your policies can't infringe my rights. I understand maybe we're well, filming like if children if and stuff. If you'd like to but... take it up with someone more senior than me, I can yeah, yeah, if you put can. you in touch yeah, with I'm, I don't want to turn it off. But for so. now, I do need you to turn that off until this is resolved. I don't want to turn it off here. Yeah, it's it's it violating my rights. I'm yeah. not violating your rights. Well, you're actually. <laughs> there's no expectation of privacy in public, so they're in public. In a building like this? Yeah, this is a public is. building, it's a government building. It's the same as any other. I just went into the council, I was filming in there, they said nothing. Just in Monash Council. Maybe they weren't aware that you were filming. No, I spoke to the guy. No, he came up and spoke to me. Yeah, and I asked him specifically, am I allowed to film in there? He said, yeah. He goes, we don't have anyone usually filming, but it's fine. Yeah. Well, like I say, you, if you have people's permission to film? I didn't have anyone's permission. He came up to me after, and he said he was okay. Yeah. yeah. Your story changed so much in that short time, I'm willing to bet that you're not being entirely honest with us. But of course, you being a frauditor, that's par for the course. No, that policy is old, and if you can't enforce it, it's, it's actually against the law. It's a legal policy, because Victorian state law says I can record in public. This is a public building. Yeah, Victorian law. Let's take a quick look at a snippet of that. Well, according to this, there are areas that may raise concerns such as swimming pools, beaches, parks, cemeteries, etc. It is advised that you check with the relevant authorities beforehand, and even the government may oppose sanctions on certain government properties such as railways, power stations, military areas, it is illegal to trespass in these areas and may lead to prosecutions. You should always check the relevant agencies for their rules and regulations, pretty much. Which clearly you're not doing. You're just walking right in there and saying that you have the right to do it. Just like an American frauditor would do, following the script to the letter. You know, so they're not 
they don't have any expectation of privacy in public. No one does. Um, yeah, if you want to get your supervisor or something, but yeah, I, I don't want to stop my recording. Unfortunately, yeah. Can I, I ask don't, you why I don't want to allow you to infringe can my I, rights. Can I, I ask you why you're recording? Or just to, it's a beautiful building and I want to see the stuff that's in here. Yeah. I pay for it, like the taxpayers pay for it. They don't, yeah. but that doesn't give the right to film people without their permission. They don't, so there's no expectation of privacy in public. You don't need permission because this is public. Like as soon as you no, step out your door, there's cameras watching you everywhere. Have, you have cameras right there, one, two. People have privacy. There are, there are kinds not, of in pro, not in public. I mean, there's, I can see two cameras right there, so you're watching them. That's there is security, no pro, that's different. But the, 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 they don't have privacy, you're watching them. So there's no privacy in public. As soon as you step out your door? It depends who is doing the filming. And <sighs> no, not really. I mean, the, you couldn't put a camera in someone's house. That would be against the law. Or in a private business or a private dwelling. Mm -hmm. So the government couldn't, this library couldn't, whoever runs it. The only reason you can put those cameras is because this is public. Those cameras are there strictly for the purposes of the security of the building. They are not going to be sold on YouTube for a profit. Unlike your videos, which will put on YouTube to try to make a bit of a profit. You know, yep. so... But yeah. you cannot film people without their permission. If you are. If it is against their will, you need to stop. You're doing it right now. You're filming everyone. Everyone. There's no expectation. You're a private individual in a public building. Right. Yes. Right. They are security cameras. Oh, this is for my security. <laughs> no, it's not. It is. It's, I want to you see what's going on. That is not for your security. It you is. Said that was for your personal interest. For my personal interest, to get everything that's happening, make sure it's all in good order. And yeah, make sure you guys aren't doing anything to the people and to the building. I mean, yeah, who's going to watch you guys? Who? Okay. I object to that statement. That is quite a disrespectful and rude accusation. And I would actually like you to leave the, the building now, please. Just because I said I'm recording for my security. Because you are not agreeing to our policies and well, your I object policies, to your, your last statement. Your policy is trying to infringe my rights. We're not trying to infringe your you rights. Are. We're trying to protect the privacy of the people in, in our public, building. While you're watching them. In public while you're watching them. With the camera. We're going around you want to just get your supervisor? I don't think I'm you know it. I want to speak to your manager. Yeah. Oh. Oh, yeah? right now, yeah. and I'm asking you to please leave. Well, I just walked in. I'm still here filming. I'm not going to leave. I'm, you have no I right. Think we'll yeah. all have to call somebody to do it. A little longer than a few minutes later. This is some signage that's developed by our communications team, yeah. which clearly, clearly states that you cannot take photos or video of anyone except for your own family or friends. Okay. How do you know that these people are my friends? I mean, I'm a community member. Oh. I'm serious, I'm a community member. Are they your friends? I probably know many of them, yeah. And do you have the permission to film them? It doesn't say that I need the permission. It doesn't say that, that I need the permission. It says that you can only film if they... It's pretty vague. It's pretty vague. I don't know why you... What's the problem with me taking because a few a photos? Because a lot of people it's object not, to being filmed but I'm not going or photographed up to people. without their permission. I'm not going up to people and engaging with them. No, but you're capturing people as you walk around the library oh. and you're being very discreet about it, which means they're not aware that they're being filmed. I'm holding it like that. How do you want me to hold it like this? I mean, they're aware that they're being filmed. They're in public, there's windows. Like, there's no expectation of privacy. I don't know what the problem is. I'm explaining what the problem is. And again, because you're saying you're because they to respect that. the policy of the city of Monash and respect the privacy of our customers. You haven't even we showed have me your security over. Yeah, I'll speak to them, but I, sure. they can't do okay. nothing. Can you please turn that off until they arrive? <sighs> I don't understand why you're around. being so difficult. I don't understand why you're being... I feel like I'm being harassed. This level of I feel refusal. like I'm being harassed. Like, all I'm doing is just... I have a right to be here. This is a public space. And I've come to take a few pictures to, to remember for myself what this building looks like. 
I'm just like, you're harassing me. You're, you're, you've called the I'm security. I'm not harassing you. I'm simply That's what trying I feel to inform like. you of the policy of the city of Monash. Yeah, I'm going to I stop understand. talking to you now I because understand. we're going around in circles yeah. and I'm no longer comfortable talking to you. Okay, well, we'll um, okay, now. thank you. I am just going to go and skip to where the cops show up because all he does is talk about laws he fails to understand. Fellas? Hello, sir. Can I just get your name and badge number? I haven't asked for your details, so oh. you don't really need to have mine, but I'm sure you can film it. That's right there, Your mate. Barnes, Acting Sergeant, and yours is Bita. Yes. You get your badge numbers, or? All 0363 is mine. Thank you. 39136. What's Thank going you very on, much. sir? Oh, I just came here to film this public, wonderful public buildings. Yes. I was in the council next door. Not a problem. And then I seen the library, and I've come in. I went in the council filming. They didn't have a problem. Yep. Came in here, and they said I couldn't film. I had to stop filming. Yeah. And inside, I said, uh, inside the building with kids and all that stuff. There's issues around just the surveillance. Stay at two meters here, just no, covered and stuff. Good, uh, I wasn't filming any kids and stuff. I wasn't. You're filming in there. You're filming. Oh, it's a public building. It's a Victorian it's state law. So. Yes, it does. Victorian yeah. state law says that I can you record. You film anyone who's not a party to any action inside a structure that they wouldn't reasonably expect to be filmed or surveilled. And if it's private conversation where they haven't given their consent, then that actually could be classed as an offence under the Electronic Surveillances Act. So if someone's having a private conversation and you haven't asked their consent for that private conversation to be filmed, then you could you could be committing. You're saying place. that people can have private conversations well, in public, it's, it's a public in a public place, building, and say so there's people there. They can't have a private conversation. So see how these people are having a conversation right now. That's yeah, they wouldn't you be wouldn't private. be able to. Uh, yes. You wouldn't be able to film them without their consent. I, absolutely, I could. No, no you because can't. Of course, I could. Yeah. They're in public. To pick up the audio there. Yeah. That's of course. I, so wherever I so. If I can stand wherever Victorian state law, I can show you the law. Okay. So Victorian right, state just, law and UN we just law. Looked up the surveillance act in anticipation of this conversation. Surveillance. I think you're so talking about uh, the electronic surveillance act. No, right? you're talking it about. It's all about filming out in public and what can and no, can't no, be filmed. No, no. Oh, fraudster! Perhaps you should have done a bit more research on your own laws rather than use American laws and an American script to try to fit your own narrative within Australia. If you had done the slightest bit of research, instead of being a total bootlicker to other frauditors, you would have found this little law right here. But hey, I don't expect that much from you frauditors anyway, considering you're nothing but a bunch of one-trick ponies that all they can do is follow a script, and the majority of you don't have an original thought in your heads. Once, no, once, not in and Michael, right? <laughs> I think you're talking about like uh, snooping, or no. it's called. Um... No. The surveillance act is as simple as pointing your iPhone at someone. Not in public, mate. Right? So if I'm. Listen, Maybe Victorian state building, law. But it's inside a structure. Victorian state law says We're that if, really I'm, have an if I'm legally here, allowed to stand to there. there yeah. And that's and what we are there. here for. So if you're in a shopping center. That's a private. Listen, business. that's a private business. If you come to a library and you don't want to listen to the, me, the hey? coordinator tells you that you need to leave the not, the two meters, please. This yeah. or angst to the public, he is allowed to tell you to leave. Okay. I wasn't causing any angst to anybody. Okay, I was that, in there for a few and minutes. And that's fine. And you are entitled to that opinion where you feel that you weren't causing any angst to anyone in the public. But as the coordinator. Of the local laws, Michael has asked you to leave. He's formed the opinion, let me finish. Yeah. He's formed the opinion and the belief that you're causing discomfort to the public and he is allowed to ask you to leave. If you don't leave, that's when allowed. we get involved. Right. And then we are now having this conversation. Right. Uh, yeah, so... Uh, so what's your, what's your first name just so I, I can address you? I'm not you. giving my name. I haven't uh, done anything wrong, so I don't want to give my name. I'm not asking you to give me all your details. Yeah. Just when I'm talking to you. Oh, Alex. 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 Yeah. Alright, so you're not allowed back in the library. Your permission to be in there has been revoked by the people in charge of those premises. Out here, fine. Yeah. Continue I'm filming. Gonna, what happens, said, I'm going to go back in. What are you going to do? Uh, you go back in there, we'll arrest you for trespass. You'll arrest me for trespass. Yes, that's exactly what's going to happen. Uh, so your right to be in there has been revoked. So if they ask you. If they asked me to leave because of the colour of my skin, you'd enforce that. And no. I refuse. You, would you I'm just asking, would no, you enforce Alex, we've, that? We're having a, you, yeah, take, your, take right. all your videos, so, let, let me just, let me just, let me just, can I right? speak for one minute? Yeah. 
So don't interrupt by both of you. So Victorian state law says that wherever I can stand legally, I'm allowed to film. I'm allowed to take pictures. No. That's not I right. Can, do you want me to pull you? That's not right. No, and because you're, you're only looking at it from one little... There. We've already explained it to you, right? <laughs> that that doesn't... That, you're that, fine out here. I'm going to lay it down for you very simply. Yeah. You enter that building again, you'll be arrested oh and charged for trespass. Wow. So you want to hang wow. out here. You film people without their consents in private moments in a place that they wouldn't that reasonably public. expect it to be... Wouldn't reasonably be expected that their private activities would be filmed you are breaching the and, surveillance and they act. could potentially be having a private conversation where they didn't give you consent for it. and you're saying that that can happen in that yes, library yes. and so out here and out here googling your victorian state law look up the electronic surveillance already, i already know that man that's for don't go in there arrest mate i'm parts. going in there you're like you, you cool you gotta... ring triple o we'll be back you can go in the cuffs and you can have your little five moments in the sun were you serious yes you will be arrested Simple as that. Well, can we just pretend that I walked in and no, can do no. the thing? No, we're not. It's very Why? simple. We told you, permission to be in well, the just I'll just walk in there now and you can oh, cool. do your thing. Yeah. What are you going to do? You'll what are you going to do? And then I will get your details. And what are you going to do after that? committed the offence and then you'll be charged for trespass. And you'll receive a summons and you will go to court and you can explain this whole scenario to a magistrate while you're wasting it. Alright, he's been told... If he goes Mate, there's no way I'm going, going back in. He's on nuts. Just thugs, eh? You just thugs come in, think you can do whatever you like, eh? Look at them, absolute tyrants, mate. You see this tyrantry? They don't even want to explain. Just go back in and we bloody mate, put your cuffs on. So many times. I'm well, explain what, what, mate? You're bloody talking about some. <laughs> Violence? Who's surveillancing in a public building? Just Alex. What Just are you listen. talking about surveillance in a my, public my, building? Michael, they're telling me about Michael's surveillance laws in a public building. Listen. That's the laws they're trying no, to tell Michael, me. Don't, don't Michael's going to point you to the them. two buildings. That Mate, there's no way. Going. Give me the trespass. Give me the trespass now. I'm going to sue you. Give me the trespass. I'll put a foot in and you, you can give me the trespass. Yeah? Cool. All right. That's the civic I've just walked into the council so building filming. They, they had no problem. It's a bloody no. government building. It's not how it works. Mate, give me the trespass. Alright, I'll walk arrested. in. Alright. Well, now, there you have it. Aussie frauder who thinks he knows his own laws. But looks like he's just like Chile de Castro and fails to understand any of them. But hey, what else can you expect from these idiotic frauditors?